President Trump's travel ban is in court, again. The Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals began to hear arguments Monday while everyone waits for the US Supreme Court to take on the case in its next session. The nation's highest court reinstated parts of the travel ban in June, but ruled it couldn't block anyone with a quote, bona fide relationship in the US from entering the country. The Trump administration says that exemption only applies to those who have parents, children, siblings, spouses, fiancés, sons and daughters-in-law, and parents-in-law already in the US. In July, a district judge ruled that definition was too narrow. Judge Derek Watson ruled it represents the antithesis of common sense. He ruled grandparents, cousins and other relatives should also be on the government's list. But Watson also found that refugees already assigned to resettlement agencies should also qualify because they have a tie to an organization in the states. That's what this newest case is about. The Trump administration wants the Ninth Circuit to overturn Watson's ruling. The Supreme Court put that part of Watson's decision on hold until the Court of Appeals decides if those refugees can be exempt. It's not clear how many refugees the ban blocked or held up, but slightly Slightly more than 50,000 refugees have been admitted in the fiscal year. A three-judge panel will eventually decide the case, the same three-judge panel that blocked key parts of the president's travel ban earlier this year.